Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be talking about blush and it is going to be my top five favorite blushes that I have in my collection right now. This is not including like palettes, this is just like single blushes that I use non-stop like crazy and I figured it's probably easier to do singles than full entire palettes singles are just easier to buy too so that's what we're gonna be doing my top five blushes so before we do start talking about those and revealing what they are please make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already but if you want to see what my top five blushes are then stay tuned for the rest of the video all right guys, I am so excited about this one because I absolutely love blush. I feel like it just really just brings life to your face, literally just ties the entire makeup look together. I just love it so, so, so much. And I'm a big peach blush lover and you guys are really gonna see that in my top five because pretty much all of them are like peachy blushes. <laughs> so, and I wore a shirt actually that is like a blush pink color. So very, very fitting for the topic we're gonna be doing today. I have, like I said, five blushes that I use non-stop right now. They're my absolute favorite. Of course, I have other blushes too. I have a lot of blush palettes that I'm obsessed with that I use all the time, but I wanted to make this video like my top five singles blushes because single products are a lot easier to buy like if you like something and it's in a palette it kind of sucks sometimes especially if you don't like all the other products in the palette so I figured this would be easier for everyone else that might even be interested in getting these because they're just on their own you don't have to get anything else with them they're just on their own so I hope that makes sense but yeah I'm really really excited so we're just gonna get into talking about the five products and I have them pulled up on their websites too so I could give you guys like pricing and everything as well because I feel like I need to do that more often I do always link them in the description box but I feel like I forget sometimes to say what the cost is in the video so we're just gonna get started the first one that I'm seeing here is the Milani baked blush this is in the shade one Dolce Pink. You guys, I this is hands down my favorite drugstore br brush blush that I have because it is like the perfect. It is a little bit on the pinkier side than it is like a peachy shade, but it has this like golden ish glow to it that just it makes the pink look so much better. Like typically, I'm not a pink pink blush kind of girl. I'm more obviously on the peachy side, but there's something about this one where I'm like, I don't care. I freaking love this. Like this glow that it has in it is, it just does something else for me. And it feels so amazing on your hand. It's so freaking pigmented, not expensive at all. This goes for $9.99 and there's so many different shades that you could get. So this hands down one of the best blushes that I've ever owned. I use it like crazy and it this has lasted me forever by the way. Literally I've had this for probably a good two or three years now and I use it all the time and it's nowhere near being empty. So this is what it looks like on my hand. You could just see that glow. It is stunning. So that's that one. Next up we have from Hourglass this is the ambient lighting blush in dim infusion if you've been on my channel for a while you already know my love for this i use this like crazy non-stop and this is another one where like a little bit goes a long way it lasts you literally forever it's like this really beautiful peachy pink with this like flesh colored powder mixed in with it and when you mix it up it just creates the most perfect perfect color this one also has like a little bit of a glow to it it's more subtle but you can really build it up to be more kind of vibrant and I've done it both ways it's really really beautiful any way you go right it's right under that Milani blush you can definitely tell it's more subtle but oh my god when it's on your face it's just 
insane. Like this does not do it justice. This does not do it justice. You have to actually put it on your face and you'd be like, oh my God. And I have so many videos on my channel where I am using this. So make sure to go check out some of my makeup videos so you can see. But this one's definitely more on the expensive side. It's $43, so definitely pricey. But I have to say, if you're gonna be spending some extra money on a blush, this is one that I would definitely say is worth spending the extra money on because it, it, has wonders for your face. Literally just makes your cheeks look flawless. The amount of color it gives is perfect, just everything. So that is that. Next I have from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This one has slowly but surely become a favorite of mine. I tried it a few months back and it didn't really impress me right off the bat. Well, it did, like I liked it, but I just didn't grab for it really after that. And lately I've been using it like crazy, like non-stop. I've just been obsessed with it and for good reason because it's freaking amazing. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Stick Blush and this is in the shade Peachy Keen. So let me show you guys what this looks like on my hand. That is pigmented. Literally this blends out like nothing I've ever seen before. It just blends out to perfection, especially, well, actually no, with any kind of applicator that you use. You could use your fingers, a brush, a beauty blender, anything, and it always just looks so amazing when you blend it out and it's like the perfect peachy color. So I am just in love with this. This one is $32, so also up there in price, but I would say that this is another one that's so worth the money. This does come with a brush on the other end of it, but I'm not a fan of this brush. I feel like could have done without it, but the packaging looks cute with it, so it's fine. I just, I always use this, never use the brush but the color itself is definitely worth it, worth the money for sure. Number four here, also, I don't know if I mentioned, I'm not going in any particular order with these. Like, I don't have like a number one, two, three, four, five. These are just like my top five blushes, not in a specific order. This is the Grande Cosmetics Grande Pop Plumping Liquid Blush. This is in shade Sweet Peach. This one goes for $25, so a little bit less expensive than the Anastasia one, but this has to be one of my all-time favorite blushes. Literally, this just gives the most beautiful, beautiful flush of color to your face. Blends out, again, so smooth, so even, works so well with other products, and it gives you this like tingly feeling on your cheeks when you put it on, and I'm obsessed. Like, I, I don't know why, maybe it does, maybe it doesn't, but I just always feel like it's like working some kind of magic on my face because it's tingling on there, and it's like the softest, most beautiful peach color ever. I love this applicator. I love a doe foot applicator on a blush. It just makes things so, so easy. Here is what it looks like swatched. You can see it's a little bit lighter than the Anastasia one. I'm obsessed with this. It's like the perfect light peachy shade and it just feels so good and tingly and cooling on your face. I'm obsessed. Like this, I probably have used second most second to the next one I'm about to talk about, but I use this like crazy. Literally, I'm surprised that this is not empty by now because I use it so, so much, but it's so worth it. You, If you don't have this, you need it in your life. And then the last one that I wanna talk about, honestly, this is probably my favorite blush of all time. I know I said I wasn't gonna be picking favorites or anything, but I just have to say, this is literally my all time favorite blush ever, 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 and it always will be. I need to repurchase because I'm pretty much out of this. It's just so good. It's always sold out though, so I can't get my hands on it just yet, but I will. I'm gonna be stalking the website till I can get it. It is the Charlotte Tilbury Glowgasm Beauty Light Wand. This is in shade Peachgasm. Look at this, it's right here in the middle. As you can see, this one just stands out like crazy in comparison to the rest of these four. It's like the perfect mix between a blush and a highlighter. Like it's like the perfect, perfect peach shade. And it has this like golden champagne -y glow to it. 
but the perfect amount of both. Literally when you put this on, you don't even need to use a highlighter on top of it because it gives the perfect amount of blushy pigment and the perfect amount of a highlight glow. You could do it with cream products, you could do it on top of powder products. It just blends in so perfectly with every other product that you put on your face. It works with everything. Literally, I cannot say enough good things about this blush. It's the best. Literally best of the best blush that you could get. It is also expensive though. This one goes for $40 as I'm looking at the website right now, which I feel like it went up in price a little bit. I thought it was 30 something before. I could be wrong. Don't quote me, but that's what I thought. I don't know. Regardless, I'm going to keep buying it until forever because it's literally the best blush I've ever had. Like, look at how much this stands out. It's insane. Literally, I cannot recommend this enough. You need this in your life. And there's other colors too. If you're not a peach person, they have pink, they have like golden highlighty ones, they have choices. So you need this. So worth it. But those are my top five. Those are the blushes that I have been absolutely obsessed with that I cannot live without, that I need in my life and that I use religiously. Like I can't stop using these. So those are my top five. I know this was a little bit quicker of a video, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love sharing products that I've been obsessed with and that I've been using like crazy with you guys so I can let you in on what I think is the best of the best. So I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Give me your thoughts though. Comment down below and let me know what you think about my choices for my favorite blushes. Let me know what your favorites are because I would love to try some new stuff. So give me some suggestions. Just say hello. Give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. But stay tuned and I will see you guys in the next video.